Hey, welcome back. What I'm going to show you here is how to animate a rotational piece in Onshape. So what I've got here is a mini wind turbine. And what I would like to do is to show how it works by showing how this rotation will occur on the motor axle. Now, in order to do this, we need to have a Revolute mate. So it's our little mate up here. And that's going to allow us to first connect these two components and then we can animate from there. So first of all, let's uh, Revolute mate here. There we go. And we're gonna put that onto this piece here. As you see, it fits on nicely. What I've actually found is that it's gone too far in. So we need to actually offset that mate. It might try 14. It's come out pretty far. I just want to make sure that the axle there, perfect, is uh, exactly where I want it to be. So I'm happy with that, mate. Cool. And we'll click OK. Now the easy part, we actually go down or move my face. We'll go right click on this revolution, mate. Right click, click on there, and we have animate. That's what we need to find. Now we can actually choose to animate it. Hopefully it's gonna rotate our turbine. There we go. From here, you can choose where it starts from and what it does. So if it reciprocate, reciprocates, it'll go around 360 and then turn back the other way. Alternatively, if you wanna make it go faster, you can reduce how many steps. So I might say 100 and I might say to loop and it should go faster and in the one direction. And I might actually say, oh, actually, if the wind's going to hit it, it's going to actually rotate the other direction. Okay, so there we go. That's how you can animate components in Onshape. I've got another PC that will animate it as well. So if I find my other Revolute, I'll right click, close out of that, right click, animate, and click here. So in this case, it's also going to spin around depending on the wind. Uh, but in this case, it would be maybe between 0 and 40 degrees. So much closer. I'll make it a bit faster. So we have 40. And you can see go left and right, depending on the wind direction. Which gives a good visual representation of how this wind type, the turbine might work as well. So there you go. See if you can animate one of your components as well.